before, after. Here's how I edited one of my favorite photos. So we said that this is how it looks like. Then we are going to crop it for Instagram or for however. I actually start with a preset. So it doesn't matter which preset you use, but I use mine. Obviously it looks different. So that's a good start. I actually shot this was an umbrella here on this side the photo. The sun was from the other side. Umbrella flash off the camera. That's how I got this photo. And then I will enable this one, which helps quite a bit. I like to use this one to make the lines straight. Then I use those things. So I have some that I created, like sunwormed, which we can add here. And another one, um, which is the sun. So we got it like this. So you see how it's done, but obviously you can just do it yourself as well. But I'll just use the sun because that's like something that works for me really good. Always. Like that. Place time so I can see the skin really good. And then I'll add a lot of radius places. Just to light everything a bit up. Yep. See, it's already starting to get somewhere. I don't like this part so much. So I've done like this. And then I took it completely white. And then because this white is more than the other one, because the curve down here is not completely white, then you can take the whites a bit off and then it matches really perfectly. And then we'll add some more sun. And then this is quite dark to me, so we can actually subject. And we can inverse it, invert it. Okay. I just don't like it here, so we'll do it manually. But basically, when you take a photo, there's a lot of power. There's a lot, a lot of power to adding those kind of things. Um, this is one of my secrets on how I create, make a photo from like a good photo to a wow photo. This can be also a bit lighter. This can be also a bit lighter. You know what, let's try something new that I haven't tried before. Just the subject to change it. Ooh, I like that. It's okay. yeah. Invert, and then I can. Here. No, I don't like the flowers like that. I like the building, but not the flowers. So we can basically take off the flowers. Then a bit more contrasted. And... Yeah, now I can try different presets if we like it better. Oh, it's very slow. Well, this could work as well if I tweak it a bit, because not like this. I think it's perfect. I don't see anything. Well, of course, we can take this thing down, because I don't have much points. And this white also, and this thing here doesn't need to be here. We can clean also the wall a bit, but that's like Photoshop work. I'm not going to do that here. I can do it here, actually. Um, I can enhance the sun a bit more. So, yeah. Yeah, I kind of like that. That's really weird. That's amazing. Yep. So this is how I did it. Before. After. The big secret is this tool. You can see how it is without it. Changes everything.